have to start you out with this glorious view that you'll see from so many rooms in this house. Going into the main family room here. Space for an office or whatever you'd like in the corner. Glass doors out onto the large deck here. This beautiful lawn area, we have that at the front as well. You know, enjoy all of this land. This little creek running down the right hand side here. Master on the main level. And of course, as you're sitting by the fireplace. You're looking out at these amazing views. So close to downtown Asheville, Swannanoa, Black Mountain, gleaming hardwood floors. Master bedroom. I love this little storage nook on the way in. Custom built table here. Good size master and you've got the bay window there. Again, I mean, really, let's just see what kind of views you're waking up to. I think I'll take a nap for a while. Look at this. I'm literally laying my head on the pillow. Don't tell anyone. This is what you're waking up to. You'll notice lots of very clever storage throughout this house. There's a walk-in closet here. Jet tub. A shower and tub. Glass blocks always good. The contractors always complain about windows in showers or bathrooms because you always end up getting some water behind them. You've got the toilet here and then the two vanities. Nice ceramic sinks there. The front door open today. It's so pretty. Even though it's winter, we get these warm winter days here. Gorgeous floors, as you can tell. They look brand new. We have a coat closet off to the left here. Don't bore you with a coat closet. We all know what they look like. Here's your half bath. this lovely keeping room off the kitchen. Again, a pretty bay at the back here, looking out onto your lawn area and this expansive deck outside. With the batten board on the side. See lots of detail, so you've got your plate rack here, or you could have it with or without plates. You've got your detail at the top here, uh, showing off your fineries, a bar here, easy access to the dining room. And here's your views from the dining room. Not too shabby again. Crown moulding, double doors on here. I'd imagine you'd leave these open a lot of the time. Let's take a closer look at the kitchen. Of 
granite and stainless steel. Appliance garage in the corner here. Plenty of storage, double sink. Looking out onto the back again. TV room. You've got those beautiful views. Imagine sitting in the chair watching your TV with those views off to the left. We'll walk through the kitchen now to the laundry. Love the size of this laundry room. There's all the storage at the top. The two side by side. No stackers in here. I can get a sense of the size of this room. And then off to the left, you can walk into the garage. There's actually a workshop to the side off the garage, which I'm going to take you into. Lots of parking out there too. So if you have more than two cars, not a problem at all. We've got at least three extra cars out there right now. Um, this is another feature I love built in. So we've got the shelves this side for the things that you want to grab. Not to fall over there. We've got a pantry this side. We've got this wonderful bonus room upstairs, which is currently used as an Airbnb. And now, let's go into the workshop. This is the fun room. See, there's the garage off the other side. Great workshop here. For anybody that needs a workshop or a craft room, you're going to love all of this space that this house offers. All that stuff that you don't want on show. And then, we're going out onto the Outside, of course, you can use the other doors off here as well. So if you've got puppies or anything else, they can run right out here. There's your hot tubs. Here's the glass door. That's off the family room where the fireplace is. This is like my longest house video in history. I'm going to take you around to the front as well. Back through the pantry so you can see yourself now coming in from the outside. We'll walk through the house. This is a true walking tour video. You can imagine yourself walking through here. Probably got you a little sun glare in there, sorry. Lots of curb appeal. You can see that from the pictures, obviously. And lots of level lawn at the top and then gently sloping down here. 